homeless for a year. 53-year-old Randy Mayfield is kicking an addiction to meth. We find needles, empty baggies. To turn his life around and get off the streets. But now it's getting easier because I can say no, because I know, I know what I want. Wanting to be productive again, Mayfield, along with close to 15 or so other homeless, have gained the support of community activists by coming up with the idea of volunteering to clean up Turlock at no cost. People went to a city council meeting, homeless people, wanting to volunteer to work and uh, just to clean up the city. Sort of like this council didn't really take into it. They were talking about bigger programs. They all left discouraged. And that's when community members jumped into action, offering bags, transportation, tools, food, and hope. If they can trust you, then they will want you to help them because they know you're going to follow through for them. The cleanup not only happens here under the freeway, but in any part of Turlock that needs it. 32-year-old Corey Doran has been homeless off and on three years. With a construction background, he's proud of his volunteer work. It gives me purpose. It makes me feel like there's a reason you know, I'm still here, you know, not to give up. The government staying out of it makes it so much better, people helping themselves. Amazingly, in just three weeks since the volunteer program began, eight have gotten part-time work as sign holders at a store, home remodeling, and more. And while it's only a start, Ricky and Corey hope cleaning up trash will lead to cleaning up their lives for good.